by itself, HTTP is very insecure because all of that information is being transferred over the network as plain text. There's no protection whatsoever. And that's problematic whenever you want to do anything with secure or, or sensitive information. And that's where HTTPS comes into play. It's still hypertext transfer protocol, but the S stands for secure. This encrypts the communication between the browser and the server so that all communication going in between those two things are completely encrypted. And in recent years, there has been a push to start encrypting everything with HTTPS. Unfortunately, it's not as easy as flipping a switch on the server and saying, hey, you know, encrypt this. There's a whole process involved. You have to purchase or, or at least obtain what's called a certificate. That certificate has to come from a certificate authority, which is an organization that provides certificates. Then you have to install their certificate on the server and you have to bind that certificate really depending upon the HTTP server software. So there's a lot involved with using or securing HTTP, but it is something that we definitely need to strive for. So in short, HTTP and HTTPS are the backbone of web communication. It makes sure that our requests go to wherever it is that they need to go and they come back safely. So every time you browse the web, you're using HTTP or HTTPS without really even thinking about it. 